join the crew. Bob and the gang have so much fun. Working together, they get the job done. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. Pilchard and Bird, Travis and Spud, playing together like good friends should. Bob the Builder, can we fix it? Bob the Builder, yes we can. <laughs> Okay, team, today we're going to build the Sunflower Valley General Store. Um, what's one of those, Bob? It's a special store that's going to sell everything we grow and make in Sunflower Valley. Mrs. Bentley's going to be our storekeeper. I've always wanted to run a store, just like my mom and dad. So, Scoop, I'll need you to dig the foundations and Dizzy to mix the concrete. Okay, Bob. Lofty, you can lift these logs. We're going to build the store with them. Oh, um, okay, Bob. What about me? What do I do? I need you to pick up the things I'm going to sell in my store, Packer. Sunflower oil. Sunflower oil. Apple juice. Apple juice. Pineapples. Pineapples. Seaweed. Seaweed. Pack me up and watch me go-go. Can we build it? Yes, we can! Uh, yeah, I think so. Here we are. Right in the middle of Sunflower Valley, so it's easy for people to get here. It's the perfect spot. I'm picking things up from around the valley, Scrambler. Can you help me find them? No problem. What's the first stop? Uh, Sunflower Oil, I think. You need the Sunflower Oil Factory Bottle Store. Follow me. I can't pack them. I can't stack them. Thanks, Sumsy. Apple juice next, please, Scrambler. After the apple bread. That's one, two, three, four. And Packer will take them to the general store. Thanks, Pickers. Okay, that's some flower oil, apple juice, uh, pineapples next. Awesome! Mr. Beasley, here we come! Some flower oil, apple juice, pineapples, seaweed next. Um, the seaweed farm! What a wonderful general store this is going to be. Thank you, Bernard. Now, you will have room for goat's milk, won't you? Goat's milk? Oh, yes, indeed. Meg McDonald is up in the mountains on Flowery Ridge milking goats as we speak. Wonderful. I'll store it in the cold section. Dizzy the Packer! Packer receiving. I've got everything Mrs. Bentley asked for, and I'm coming back. But not yet, Packer. Mrs. Bentley wants something else, too. Meg McDonald's goat's milk. Goat's milk? No problem. She's up on Flowery Ridge. Flowery Ridge? If Mrs. Bentley wants it, Packer gets it. There you go, Packer. Thanks, Annie. Bye. Uh, where's Flowery Ridge? Follow me! Scram to the mountain! Okay, Packer, this is as far as you can go. But Mrs. Bentley wants me to go all over the valley. Yeah, but the track up to Flowery Ridge is really bumpy. Why don't I go and get the goat's milk? I'm an off-roader, you see. I'm made for hard to get to places. But I'm the delivery truck. Whatever Mrs. Bentley wants, Packer gets. Well, okay. See you later, alligator. Hello, rabbit. It's kind of rocky around here, ain't it? 
That's a way to Flowery Ridge. Mmm, lovely fresh milk. Thank you, Gertie Goat. <laughs> Hello? A delivery truck. We don't see many of you up here in the mountains. I'm Packer Mag McDonald. I'm here to pick up your goat's milk for Mrs. Bentley's general store. Good for you, Packer. Here you go. Fresh from Gertie Goat. Be careful on your way down, Packer. I will. Bye, Meg. I've got everything now. Mrs. Bentley will be so happy. And uh, it's, uh, it's quicker going down. I'm stuck. Packer to Dizzy. Packer to Scrambler. Packer to anyone. anyone. I must be out of range. Oh, brother. Scrambler was right. I should have let him come up here. He's the off-roader, not me. Silly Packer. <laughs> Hello, Gertie. I'm stuck and I... Oh, I know. You're good at getting around hard to get places, aren't you? <laughs> Can you go and tell everyone I'm stuck on Flowery Ridge? to call Packer. It's time for delivery, so I can fill the store shelves. Don't worry, Mrs. Bentley. Packer will be here any minute with everything from all over the valley. He's even gone up to Flowery Ridge. Flowery Ridge? But Packer's too big to go up there. That's what I said, Bob, but he wanted to go. For you, Mrs. Bentley. Oh, but I... But... <laughs> What's that, Mrs. Goat? She's saying Packer's stuck. Stuck? Oh, man. I told him it was a job for me. Come on, Scrambler. Show us where he is, Gertie Goat. <laughs> Scrambler. Gertie, thanks for coming. Don't worry. We'll get you back on the track, no problem. I think I'm too heavy to get back down, with my big load and all. Yes, a mountain's a really tough place for a delivery truck, all right. Wait a minute. Scrambler, could you take everything down? Then my trailer will be lighter and I can get down the mountain. Everything? You can make a lot of trips. And Gertie Goat can take something, too. <laughs> Packer. Oh, it wasn't just me, Mrs. Bentley. I tried to go all over the valley, but... Oh, Packer, I didn't expect you to go absolutely everywhere. You work together with your friends. That's what matters. And thanks to all of you, the store is ready to open. Oh, look, here come the customers. Ladies and gentlemen, as mayor of Sunflower Valley, it is my very great pleasure to declare the very first store in Sunflower Valley open! Everything from all over the valley, brought to you by... Packer the Delivery Truck! Rambler the Off-Roader! And Gertie the Goat! <laughs> Ready yet, Bob? Yeah, I can't wait. Building a cottage in the forest is going to be brilliant. Who 
Who's the cottage for, Bob? It's for Chip, the woodsman. What's a woodsman? A woodsman is someone who looks after trees, Lofty. Should we go and meet him? Don't we need to pick up some building materials first? Not this time, Lofty. We'll be using wood from the forest. A cottage built out of wood for a woodsman? How brilliant is that? Hello, Spud. What are you doing here? I've come to meet Chip. Farmer Pickles told me all about him. Uh, yeah. wow. Hello, I'm Chip Chipper, the woodsman. Hello, Hello Chip. Chip. I'm Bob, and this is Wendy, Scoop, Muck, Dizzy, Rolly, Lofty. And I'm Spud. Have you come to chop all the trees down with your big saw? <laughs> no, Spud. I'll use my saws to coppice the woods. Coppice? What's that? You cut the wood in a special way so you don't hurt the tree's roots and stump. That means it can grow again, eh? So the tree recycles itself. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Reduce, reuse, recycle. Are we ready to start building this cottage? Can we build it? Yes, we can. I think so. I'm going to be a woodsman today, just like Chip. A woodsman? How? Easy. I'll copy whatever Chip does, then ta-da! I'll be a woodsman too. Better go. A woodsman's work is never done. Big mallet, just like chips. Ah, 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 yes, this one's better. And we'll use ropes to pull it up. Does this help? It'll be hard work raising the real thing, eh? Do we have enough timbers to make the frames? We need one more. Leave it to me, Bob. Two, three. Uh, uh. Hello, Chip. I've come to get some timber. Great. Do you need any help? Oh, no. I know exactly what to do. If you're sure. See you back on the side, eh? Bye, Chip. Woodsman Spot spots the timber. One, two, a three. It's much harder than it looks. I did it. I am a woodsman. Said he missed the big pull. Oh, yeah. Where is he? Here I am. Spot the woodsman. Oh, no. The frame. Mutt to the rescue. That was close. I'm really sorry, Bob. I, uh, uh, excuse me. I didn't mean to drop the log. And, and well, I... I know, Spud. That log was way too heavy for you. It's a good thing you didn't get hurt, Spud. Come on, team. Let's get back to work. What's next, Bob? We've got to secure this frame, make the floor and roof. And we'll need some straw bales for the walls. Should I get some from Farmer Pickles? Great idea, Muck. Scoop, can you go too? No problem, Bob. Here you go, Bob. Wait, 
We can get started on these walls. And I'll get started on the roof. Good idea, Wendy. You need more tiles, Wendy. I'll bring some over, eh? Hey, Spud, do you want to help with the straw bale wall? Sorry, Scoop. I'm too busy being a woody woodsman. Wow, Chip. Did you make these wooden tiles yourself? Yes, sirree. Yeah, and the wooden nails. Don't load too many tiles there, eh? They're pretty heavy. Okay, Chip. <laughs> they're after the nails. They think they're acorns. Shoo! Shoo! I better get these on site, eh? I'm right behind you, Chip. <laughs> Hello, squirrels. Have you come to watch Spard the Woodsman? What do you mean I'm not a woodsman? Just you watch this. <laughs> Hey, Wendy, more tiles. See, little squirrels, see. Yes, I can do that too. I told you, I'm a woodsman just like Chip. Spud, what are you doing? Dropping the tiles. Watch out. Oh, I'm really sorry I broke your lovely tiles, Chip. Oh, no. Look at the big holes I've made. Why were you carrying so many tiles? I was copying Chip. I want to be a woodsman just like him. Oh, Spud. You can't just copy Chip and become a woodsman. Why not? He's my hero. Oh, there's a lot to learn first. A lot to learn? Oh, yeah. You gotta know all about the different trees and how to cut, carry, and carve them. It takes a lot of time and lots and lots of practice. Really? So, I can't be a woodsman today? Mm, no. But you could start learning today, and over time, you'll become a woodsman just like me. Maybe I'll stick to being a scarecrow. I've already had lots of practice at that, and I'm very good, aren't I? You're a brilliant scarecrow, Spud. Okay, everyone, let's get this cottage finished. I'll get them for you, Bob. Oh, we can't finish the roof without those nails, eh? Shoot! Get away from those nails. They're not ankles. Oh, got them. <laughs> oh, well done, Spud. Scarecrow Spud will protect your nails. Great. Let's get the roof finished. It blends right in with the forest. We couldn't have finished it without you, Spud. Really? Yeah! You are one super scarecrow. Oh, no, you don't. That's not a tree. Get away from that roof. Go on, shoot. Ah, 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 ah. 